Mexican food. And she's back over there, that bed. We um have chicken manure in some of the beds down here. Oh. And then these other beds has rabbit manure in them. And I just did the side beds all up and along there with rabbit manure. What's up, YouTube fam? Welcome back to the channel. So, guess what? We're outside, finally. I took my jacket off. It's a little warm, but it's still a little chilly out here at the same time. But when you start working in your jacket, I was like, man, it's hot. I gotta, I gotta go. I need to get my water. Matter of fact, I think I left my water in the house. I gotta go back in the house and get my water now. But anyway, <laughs> pleasure. That's my husband. So, I have over here you can't see her because she's on the side but i have gracie over here my husband got her tied to the chicken coop since that's her favorite spot and we can keep an eye on her there out of the sun my husband's sitting here under the gazebo and we've already started out here in this garden so i said sundays was going to be my homesteading gardening days along with one other day during the week so today is sunday and i hope you sit back and enjoy this video hit that like button share it subscribe um that's the best way to get the content out and this is my peaceful place kind of not today because i'm here <laughs> not today because my husband is here girl 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 sit sit good sit gracie 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 okay let me go get my water so i have my water but i wanted to show you a sneak peek look at my squash y'all they already blooming they ready to give me food soil is dry so when i'm done in the yard then i'll come in here and water everything down fill the pans with water put water in the cups look at the tomatoes oh beautiful bell peppers thing for water my tomatoes definitely gotta give them some water pickling cucumbers broccoli right here summer um pumpkins well sweet pumpkins and watermelon and also down here is jalapeno more jalapeno more tomatoes i'm love seeing this right here because one start at lowe's home depot is gonna cost you like anywhere between three and six dollars depending on what that start is so this is actually real time today is sunday and it is 12 12 right now we've been at it for at least an hour and a half maybe now so you get this video on the same day it was actually recorded how nice is that right hit the like button really gracie wow this is our huge raised bed this came with the property already together we actually installed everything else we did ourselves even the composter down there so if you're new to the channel let me back up to show you this is the back side of our property chicken coop here rabbits there gazebo area and then we we made this whole little section here even have beds on the outside these were the first two beds we had when we first got to this property in 21 these are my onions they have died come back and now they're budding um 
these beds here so there's three here three here and then these little side beds right here and the trellises cattle panel right here this bed though has given us the most headache because actual trees grow up in it so he's trying to cut them down at the base um I don't know if it's going to be this weekend or what, but because the day's already Sunday. But we have to till this up. And I think because we have grown corn and watermelon and pumpkin in here before, and it did fine. I don't know if I'm going to do corn in here. You can see some of the old stalks in here, right here. So I probably won't do corn in here. But I think all of this will be like a melon and pumpkin bed. Not concerned with that this year. It still looks good. Once I get the blower and blow everything and stuff, it'll look fine. Town. Probably because of the shade. Look at that. Cabbage survived the whole winter. I ain't gonna mess with it. Thank you. And if you if we burn that stump, if it it won't grow back anymore, you think? I don't know. I have to look into that. Timber. <laughs> Bags. If you stay, if, if it's eight dollars. Yeah, but that's how much cubic feet you get. Huh? You getting how many cubic feet? One, two. No, you getting two bags per uh, container. Yeah, but bag sizes are different. I mean, you don't want to max out eight dollars. She put her mind to late night hours up the hill, serving coffee to strangers, talking about revenue. She kept dreaming of a world big enough for everyone. But she knew it must rain before it grows. She kept dreaming of the day butterflies survive the wheel, even though she could not down in the show.
so from my backyard I can look through the trees I don't know if you can see it but there's a lake a huge lake right there lake I don't know if it's Lake Hickory or what but yeah because this is where all of the rainwater washes down here but right straight through there there's the lake So we got those trees out as far as, you know, the limbs, of course, it's still rooted in the ground. But nonetheless, that part's done. Only thing left to do is to weed and till. And I don't think that's happening today. So that's going to, are you blowing this today? So I think that's all we're gonna do for today. That's the bulk of the stuff. So this will be part one. And part two, you'll see next Sunday, hopefully, <laughs> of me tacking in the staples into the um, coverings here and blowing everything out. You know, once we get our soil in, be ready to start planting and stuff like that. So everything is going to be in stages so that it's not overwhelming but so we're gonna end the video here because i gotta go do her ear we'll try to get it cleaned and then do her ear so from my family to your family get out there and start growing plant a seed today grow your food tomorrow because you know they want to control how much you have you do it yourself you don't have to worry about that right right yeah right she agrees good kisses one of the best things you can do for your family is to start a garden get your seeds figure out what you're going to grow, where you're going to grow it, how you're going to grow it, and get busy doing that. You don't have to have a garden bed. You can use buckets like you see the white buckets right there. Just do something because relying on someone else is giving them control.
we stay here forever?